video has no kind of topic. I want to talk about MMA. We don't have any structured like three tips for fat loss or four tips for bigger legs or a bigger butt or bigger biceps. Today, we're talking about the MMA fights. And, you know, we got a Long Islander. We got a dude from Colorado. And that's what we're talking about. And also, this is how I de-stress from the week. So everybody has their own thing to de-stress. Some people do, you know, some people drink. Some people... Uh, eat lasagna. I do that as well. Some people watch Games of Thrones. Some people watch Barry. You know, these are fun things. So we want to talk about this video will not be for you if you're looking for some very fast absorb, fast content, fitness content to get you some abs in three weeks. This is not going to be that. And if you don't like to talk about UFC, you should exit out now. But if you do like UFC and you like ice cream, hey, go see. Right over here. Let's have a chat. So listen. I want to know who's your favorite MMA fighter. My favorite MMA fighter, I like Bendo Henderson. That's my guy. Cool dude, man. Cool dude and just smooth. That's why I like me smooth. But tonight we got Al Iaquinta. Now, Al's from Long Island. I believe Wantor. I'm from Freeport. So we used to, um, our teams used to, you know, wrestle off. I used to wrestle. Um, I wrestled in high school. He wrestled in high school. Um, he went on the MMA. Obviously, I went on the fitness. <laughs> but um, he's fighting Cowboy Cerrone, and this is a really interesting match because it's like, first off, I got Al winning, so that's that's all I got. So if you watch UFC, let me know who you have. But Al, tough as hell, really good, pretty good jits. So he's a black belt. Al has great pressure, great striking. Um, Cerrone's kicks are no games. His submissions are no games. And Cerrone's also seasoned, so he has, a, you know, a few more fights now. But Al is game, man. Like, that guy is tough. I was watching. He fought Kevin Lee his last fight. That guy is tough. But Cerrone's been doing this. Cerrone's been knocking heads for a long time, too. So, I don't know, man. T close fight. See it going the distance, but I got Al winning. Um, I just think he, I just, just think he's a better fighter, man. But Cerrone is game. Like, that guy's a killer. Great, you know, great competitor. But I think Cerrone's going to win. Now, that's that. I'm not sure who, who the other, I'm not sure who the co-main is, but that's the main event. So what we also have going on is uh, my boy Randy Brown is fighting in June in Charleston. He's fighting basically the guy, they call him Bam Bam. First of all, Randy Brown is one of the best strikers ever. Like, his striking game is phenomenal like i personally obviously i'm not fighting but i've seen like he is i've seen him train his striking is absolutely incredible so he's also uh trains out of long island budokan and valley stream great dojo but he's he's also fighting a guy named uh some dude named bam bam he, he basically beat sage northcutt i think that's his claim to fame but obviously i think randy brown is gonna off him um by ko because I think Randy Brown's just that much better than him. And I might, I might be biased. I don't know. But I just I just know Randy Brown's that much better than him. So, if you guys... I think we should also try to get Randy on the Hassani show. What do you think? You want to get Randy on the Hassani show? And finally, my brother, we got Dre the Bull fighting. Um, January 23rd, right over here, around the corner. I'm in I'm in, uh, I'm in Uniondale. He's fighting literally a block a block north from here. He's fighting, uh, he's fighting in the PFL. I actually don't know who he's fighting. And he's giving me hell for this all the time. I actually don't know. Um, I would be shocked if he knows as well. But I don't know. But obviously, I got the bull win. And if you don't know who Dre is, first Google him. Him and or Randy. Google those two. Um, Dre's been on the show, I think, two times. So check the channel. You'll see uh, Mindset with Dre the Bull. And uh, that was my UFC picks, man. So who we got coming up? Tell me about your your exciting UFC, uh, your favorite UFC fights that you have coming up. Who do you want to win? Who's your favorite fighter? I want to hear all that in the comment section. So give me a like, comment, and your favorite fighter. Like, comment, favorite fighter. That's what I need from you in the comment section. Um, And UFC, you know how lasagna is, but we're going to talk about Barry. So if you like Barry, man. Barry, to me, my personal opinion. It's up there with Games of Thrones. Like, it's up there. Barry is a creative... It's a, the most creative show I've seen in such a long time. I, 
I can't explain it. Like the writing is sensational. The acting is acting is pretty awesome too. But if you don't know what Barry is or who Barry is, Barry's basically a hitman who is from Cleveland who 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 gets hired to kill somebody in LA, drives to LA, basically becomes buddy buddy with the dude that he was supposed to kill. He drops him in a guy's improv class and they become friends and then he the teacher says he sees him, he could be an actor, so he drops his killing career to be an actor, mid-career. So imagine you have, you're a hitman, and you walk up into a classroom, and a teacher says, you know what, that was pretty good, and you see you have some potential. And you're like, really? You put the gun down and start acting. <laughs> Every season is crazy. <laughs> Every episode is crazy. It's only 30 minutes. So, I personally love Barry. I think it's one of the greatest shows ever, like, If I had to pick Barry or GOT, Barry, easily. So, that's how we're going to wrap it up. I'm almost done with this ice cream because this is great. Having, I'm having one hell of a Saturday and pretty awesome. Um, but I want to hear from you. Like, what do you have going on and stuff? Put in the comments. You know, like, comment, share. Don't forget. Put your favorite UFC comment. Yeah, UFC fighter. Barry or Game of Thrones? In the comments. That's really it. If if you want to, if you want to talk about fitness, we'll do that tomorrow. But go to the site, go to the top of your browser, put authentichas.com. You'll see it. You'll see articles, online coaching if you want. But I'm not talking about that today. But authentichas.com or in your Google bar, authentic dash coaching. And um, you'll be able to get it. So that's all we got. I want you to be safe this weekend. Don't drink and drive. Uh, drink plenty of water, meditate, watch UFC, watch Barry eat a little bit of lasagna, work out more, drink water, eat your plants, do the good stuff. I'm Coach Haas. You can find me at Instagram at Authentic Haas, uh, on Authentic Haas. That's Instagram. Facebook as Haas Adkins. YouTube, you're already on here. Thank you. Facebook, you're on here as well. So that's how we feel. I got to go. I'll talk to you soon.